say hola papi just wanted to wish you a happy father's day and make you a little video this is your virtual card um i just took some time to write a list of the reasons why i love you and everything that you taught me um i'm gonna start out with i'm so thankful that you helped me to succeed in school whether it was driving really early in the morning to help me get to a tutoring session for math, even the chemistry class with Mr. Stevens, but that's okay. <laughs> um, and then I'm so thankful for your emphasis on education. Like I loved that anytime I was struggling with something, whether it was saying no or exercising, you'd turn me to an audiobook, which has helped me a ton and still to this day. And then I also loved that you would do special talks with us every month. And I loved that whenever I was struggling with something, I knew that you were there to help me. And it's crazy because I've been to like a few different counselors in my life, but it was crazy. I remember uh, going to one and I'm like, man, my dad would give me better advice. <laughs> so I just think you're a really good counselor and you always know uh, what to say and how to help me to do better. So I'm so thankful for that and that you took the time to do that. Uh, let's see. And another thing I wrote down is that I loved that, I thought that was cute that you do the little like bean cups and do special days even though I was the older child <laughs> and I, I loved those like I wrote down some of the special days like you took me to dinner and then we went and watched Herbie Fully Loaded which was as an adult watching those kind of movies I, I thought that meant so much that you would go see those with us and like the rewards for reading the Book of Mormon every week like when you went to see the Justin Bieber movie with us that's a good dad right there. So you're awesome. <laughs> and then another thing I wrote down was you always made my birthday really special. Like I remember I used to not know how to do makeup and I'd put on super dark eyeliner and make my face orange. And you took me to Faze's salon and sat there and waited with me as they taught me how to put on makeup and uh, how to look naturally pretty. So that meant a lot. Um, and I love that you took each of us on like a ninth grade trip. And that was super fun going to New York. And you were so patient even as I threw up on the plane and everything. <laughs> and, <laughs> and I was sick when we got there. But then I remember thinking it was the coolest thing ever that you let me plan out our trip like going to the Modern Art Museum and uh, I remember staying at the Edison Hotel and going to see Wicked and you're the best dad because I know that all of us chose Wicked so you probably saw it like five times but it means so much that you always think of our interests and uh, that you really care about us. And then another fun memory, I was just thinking about how in I think it was fourth grade or fifth grade um, they had the ski days for the elementary school and that was so fun that you took me and my friends like I think it was me and Candace and we went up skiing the whole day and I thought that that was so fun and that was just such a fun memorable day and then I still remember um, when mom would have like her early society nights that you would take us out to eat like at the clock diner and you taught us how to like blow the little wrapper off the straw and like use it like a gun <laughs> and, like the just all the little fun things um and then also it's just meant so much to me that you've sacrificed so much and provided such an awesome life for our family whether it's taking us on awesome family vacations like Hawaii and New York and church history trips uh, paying for dance lessons piano lessons tennis 
uh, helping me pay for college uh, and a beautiful house for us to live in. That has meant so much. And the older I've gotten, I've realized how much you've sacrificed. Like, I just see mo a lot of dads spend a lot of their money and time, like putting it into hobbies, like watching football or boats or uh, different things like that. And I really admire that you've put your time and money into our family. And I think the older I get, the more I realize how rare that is. And so I just want to thank you for that. And just thinking about how much you've sacrificed for our family. So I remember uh, getting home from my mission and being worried about paying for school. And that just meant so much that you took your bike, your really nice bike, and you sold that to help me go to college. And uh, that, like you just sacrificed so much for our family and I sure love you. Aww. And also, I'm so thankful that you live worthy as a priesthood holder. There's been so many times where I've been able to come to you for a priesthood blessing to get direction and comfort, and those have helped me through some of the hardest times in my life, and I'm sure thankful for that. Um, and also, I wrote down, I'm so thankful that Dad helped us to move because that was a huge job moving across the country to Texas and um, you were so nice even though we went to that ghetto uh, hotel with the popcorn ceiling and <laughs> the dirty sheets. You're, so, you're such a good sport and I, I was just thinking about how you've always had like a good attitude about everything. Like I feel like I've never seen you have a bad attitude and being an adult, like not swearing, that's really hard. And I admire that you, I don't think I've ever heard you swear. Um, yeah, also back to the whole like helping us move, that just meant so much, like since I was starting work with the next day after you helped us move, that you, even though I was exhausted and I couldn't keep going, it meant so much that you and Aaron like helped get our apartment all set up and everything. And I'm so thankful that even as an adult, I can still call you and you still have the best advice. And I know you, that you're blessing so many lives as a bishop and you know, I sure admire the relationship that you and mom have. And I just wanna let you know that I love you so much and wish I could be there to give you a hug today. Uh, love you and can't wait to see you this next month. Happy Father's Day, Dad.